So our last race from Newbury is going to be a two mile four handicap. 140 over the big fences, so stitching time for Pontypool Racing's at top weight. New Year's Day for Marty Needham, Cleopatra for Leon Van Rensburg, Darren Thompson sends St. Hernando, Diana the Dave Padrick Hogan, Daniel French's prototype, Al Kudia for David Hooley, David Robertson's Ellie's Politon, Lycra. Oh, like a property for Darren Thompson, Craig Beckwith's Dark Alert, Yuma 1 for Vinnie Gerrard, Steel George for Stu Gray, Pontypool Race in October Bay, Roller 6 for Craig Beckwith, Stu Gray's Hardstone, Strong Arrow for John Morgan, and El Villar Bird also for Vinnie Gerrard. Makes up a reasonably large field here of 16. The starter's got him away. No fewer than four last time out winners. Let's see if anybody can follow up. Half furlong or so. It's strong arrow that takes it up. It's going to lead us out along with a prototype. They're just about three or four lengths away from San Hernando as they get to the first of the 16. They're all over that slow jump by second place prototype into a small ditch. Quite quick, a couple of slow jumps towards the rear. Alcudia, who, uh, if I remember rightly, last week jumped poorly but still won as they go over the third. Strong arrow for John Morgan that leads us by three to Prototype, who's dropped back into the main pack now in Dark Alert and St. Hernando as they go to the fourth. They, they didn't clear it, and it's Alcudia that's gone. Didn't get away with the mistakes this week. So that's one of our last time out. Winner's gone as they go over the water. So it is this Strong Arrow that leads from Prototype in second, and then we've got Dark Alert and St. Hernando stitching time out top weight with Stablemate at Toba Bay up against the Raoul is the green silks of Yuma 1, out wildest of always like a property. And we've got Cleopatra and New Year's Day. Wider still is Ellie's Politon for David Robertson. And the yellow silks of Die Another Day, still George. El Villar Bird, manager on second run up. Roller 6 for Craig Beckwith. I think Hardstone for Stu Gray, just towards the rear. Still George shuffles back, but it's Strong Arrow that leads, but he's. Advantage is down to just a length and a half now to prototype. They get to the six, the back straight, and they'll clear that well. Good jump there at the rear up by Hardstone. Jumped himself up a few places. As we continue along the back straight. It's strong arrow that leads them over the small ditch. That's seven. A nine to take. Arrow, happy to bowl along in front, leads by a couple to prototype and dark alert as he gets another plain one. He will clear that, slow again at the rear was El Villar Bird. So done a mile and a half, a mile left to run as they approach the tent. Oh, we've lost one there, and this time it's like a property that's gone for Darren Thompson. His other runner in here is St. Hernando, who's sitting pretty in fourth at the moment. But it is Strong Arrow from Prototype, Dark Alert and San Hernando. Top weight stitching time in October Bay together. And then New Year's Day, Hardstone and Cleopatra and Yuma 1. They're followed through by Steel George and Roller 6. Then we've got Just Die Another Day and El Villar Bird at the rear. Ellie's Politan. It's just uh, starting to improve now up on the outside. So he reached the 11th. It's all change up front. It's Prototype that's now taken this up from Strong Arrow. It just shuffles back a bit. St. Hernando and Dark Alert. You know one making it some good ground now and improving up on the wide outside. Here comes Stitch in time. The top weight is Stable Mate. October Bay's got locked in. Nowhere to run. They're followed through by Hardstone. Then we've got New Year's Day. Ellis Politan. Roller 6 and still George and Cleopatra as they go over the 12th. Five from home. We're just four to take now. It's still this Prototype that leads them into the ditch of 13th but being challenged now by St. Hernando and our top weight stitch in time. Strong Arrows coming back into this. Dark Alert's trying to pick up. Picking up all the time is still George as they go over the 14th three from home. And it's this St. Hernando with a couple of length advantage now from St. George and Strong Arrow. Prototype is starting to go backwards. Running on well now is Dark Alert and Roller 6 as they go over the penultima. It's St. Hernando still with a three length advantage from Strong Arrow. Still George in third. Yuma 1 is fourth. Dark Alert. El Villar Bird and Ellie's Politan as they go over the water. It's a 
good jump there by Strong Arrow. Strong Arrow throws down the challenge to St. Hernando, and it's Strong Arrow that takes it up inside the final furlong, and it's Strong Arrow from St. Hernando. Still George running on, Re Yuma one trying to close the gap all the time, but I think this Strong Arrow, the post is going to come in time, it's Strong Arrow that's going to take this from Still George and Yuma one finishing well on the outside is El Villar Bird. Certainly the last place as we made the turn. A win there for John Morgan takes the bet for handicap chase. Our last race from Newbury. Race 10 from El Villar Bird and Numa 1. Very Gerard get up for second and third there. Well done. Still George Stu Gray was fourth. And Dark Alert for Craig Beckwith was fifth.